Wait a second, writer strike? What's happening now? Hi, I'm Megan, I'm an aspiring TV writer and I share all things entertainment industry here on my YouTube channel. I wanted to talk today about the upcoming writer strike that we may see happen in May of 2023. Yes, this will be the first writer strike since 2008 when all of a sudden we got fall breaks in our shows. So I want to talk about what's happening and what my opinion on it is because as somebody who's trying to break into this industry, it is something to think about and to understand and prepare for. So let me start by explaining what's led to this point because there are a lot of different factors that kind of go into getting to the point of a potential strike and I'm sure I won't hit on all of them but I want to kind of give an overview of where this is coming from. A major factor that's leading to this strike is streaming. When streaming services first kind of hit the industry, they were considered new media. And that gave them a lot of freedoms in terms of working conditions and how they kind of got away with things. But nowadays, streaming is at least on par with network, if not the majority of media we see. So it needs to be treated as such when it comes to working conditions and how writers are being paid. So one of the major points about this comes to residuals. A lot of writers could survive off of the residuals they got from their shows being on network television. But that's not the same thing that happens with streaming. With streaming, residuals are next to nothing compared to what writers get with network shows. Then on top of that, with shorter episode orders, what used to be 20 to 25 week jobs are now 8 to 10 week jobs. When you can't rely on those residuals to kind of get you through the break between jobs, writers have to be constantly searching for new jobs so they can just make ends meet. And on top of that, writers bring a lot of value to a show and to the streaming services they end up on. Now let's talk about my feelings about it. Of course I'd prefer a strike not to be happening. It makes it harder to break into this industry and it's not great positioning for where I'm going into things. But at the same time, I truly believe in why this strike is happening and I understand why it's important. And I'd much rather be going into an industry where a lot of these issues have been resolved than be able to get a job but have to still deal with these issues. So I think that it's important to understand where this is coming from and Yes, of course, I wish it wasn't the case, but that doesn't mean I don't understand and support why it's happening. And what it comes down to is that I really do know that these strikes happen to protect writers and create better working conditions for them, which all sounds good to me. There's a professional screenwriter that I follow on TikTok and I will link her stuff and whatever, but this is Julia Yorks and she talks about how sometimes when it comes to creative jobs and you know, in particular screenwriting, just cause that's where her experience is, that sometimes writers end up accepting poor working conditions because they're living the dream. But this is still a job and it needs to be treated as such. So while strikes can be difficult and they can kind of create hardship, they're really important to make sure that writers are being treated fairly in the jobs because again, at the end of the day, this is still a job. And I think that what it really comes down to is that if the conditions stay as they are, screenwriting, TV writing, they're not gonna be viable long-term career options. So again, I said it like three times in this video, is it unfortunate that this is happening? Can it create a bit of tension and issues within the industry? Yes but I think that it's important and I think that it needs to happen if the working conditions aren't going to improve themselves on their own. I wanna know what you think about the strike. Do you think it will actually happen? Do you think that it's just going to be a threat and then finally that threat will be enough to change things? And do you support the strike and what it stands for and what it's trying to do for writers? I would love to hear what you think in the comment section. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe and press the notification bell so you don't miss any of my new videos. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next week. Bye.